Hi YouTube, it's your girl for the woman and me. I'm laying around on the sofa today. Um, not, I feel okay, I just don't have a lot of energy. And so I just wanted to come and do a video because I am 24 weeks and two days today. Um, I would like to do my videos every two weeks, but lately with my fatigue, I'll get up and, um, you know, I have two older kids that live in the house with me and I have little kids, but my two older kids, I get up and I do breakfast for them and hubby and I work, you know, I work from home. And by the end of the day, I want hubby to record videos for me so I can do my belly shots and everything and I'm usually just so tired. So I felt like too much time has um, elapsed from my last video. So I'm going to do a little brief update and then maybe when I can get hubby to do a little recording I'll come back. But usually I'm so beat and he's looking out for me lately, you know, with the pregnancy. He has to um, kind of step it up and cook more and help me do more with the boys. So he's kind of worn out as well. But I want to continue to make my videos so that my little one one day when she grows up will know how much her mommy and daddy loved her and awaited her arrival and her brothers were so excited for her to be here. I would love to do a video with my boys so that they can say something to the baby as well. Uh, from the last three weeks, a lot has changed with my pregnancy symptoms. I'm starting to, I guess you can look in my face and say, oh, now, yeah, of course, I still have the acne. That has been since day one, but it is getting better. The camera may not show it, but it looks a lot better than it used to. It was really bad. Um, within the last three weeks, I'm noticing, I'm trying to swell a little. It's not bad, but I do notice a little swelling. Prior to about, I want to say like last week, if I was sitting down, people couldn't really tell that I was pregnant, you know, through my face or anything, but, you know, you can kind of look at my lips and my cheeks and my nose. You can kind of see the pregnancy look about me. So I'm starting to have that now. You know, people would see my belly, but they would kind of like go, is she pregnant or is she just maybe fat, you know? So I am looking more distinctly pregnant in the face. My arms and legs haven't gotten too big. It's not too bad. Excuse my messy house. Like I said, I'm just really tired today, but I wanted to come on and do a video and just say hello and let you guys know how I'm doing. Uh, I have a doctor's appointment on Wednesday. I have to do my glucose test. I'm not looking forward to it. But I'm sure everything will be fine. I've not had diabetes with my other pregnancies, so I don't think I would have it this time. I feel fine. My sleep apnea has seemed to have gotten better this week. The last two weeks before I did the video, I would just couldn't sleep at night and just sleep all day and just felt like a zombie. But last week, for a whole week, seven days, I slept at night, I get up in the morning, I feel good. Today I really think my fatigue is from just being pregnant and baby growing and mommy needing to rest. I don't think it's, you know, I don't feel sick or anything. I just need to kind of relax. I think this is just a normal pregnancy thing. I don't feel like it's related to my sleep apnea at all. I've attempted to do a lot of cleaning because I've said in other videos I live in a kind of small starter home and the rooms are small and closets are really small. I would wanted to clean out my boys' closet and combine them in the same closet because currently they don't share a closet. When I went through my older son's closet, it amazed me. My son, um, the last time I had gone shopping, he was still in boys, you know, in youth sizes, uh, 1820, and I knew he had gained a little weight and that I could probably stand to go up a size for him. Well, my son, <laughs> he's in men clothes, which I expected, you know, because most youth sizes don't go up past a 20. Well, he was a 34. I was expecting maybe he would be a 30 in the waist. 
and maybe depending on how the pants or whatever may have been cut, maybe a 32. My son wears 34. He is 13 in the eighth grade. So I had to clean out his entire closet. And with me doing it, you know, we have his eight-year-old brother. He's actually growing a lot faster than my eight-year-old grows faster than my 13-year-old. So he catches his brother's clothes really fast. So I save them because I buy really nice things or whatever. So if it's in good condition or whatever, I save them to pass down to little man. So once I did that, I had to clean out little man's closet. And needless to say, let me just put it like this. Yes, I got rid of maybe like five bags of clothes, tall bags. I've sent them to Goodwill, but the closets are still full. <sighs> what can, you know, what can you say? So I don't think little mama will have a closet. I think we're going to have to give her drawer space, and I may try to get a um, more if the space in this house will allow. I don't plan on moving anytime soon. I really love my little house. It's cozy and I, I really do love it. Even though the space is limited and I know I'm gonna need to upgrade, I'm really happy with my home. I really like it. Maybe, you know, through my search, I'll find something that I love just as much. Um, it took me three years to find this home. Not that I'm a very picky person. I I think I'm kind of a I'm a, I live in the city, but I'm kind of a country girl, so I like rocking chairs on the front porch. You know, in the city they do patios and it's in the back. I'm just a little different, so it's certain things I like. And I like to have a place where my family can come and just enjoy themselves and not feel like they can't touch anything, you know, or they're not welcome. So I just like a very comfortable environment. Enough about that. Um, like I said, I'm starting to swell a little. I do have the pregnancy look. I get heartburn sometimes. It's not bad as I've had in my previous pregnancies, but I'm starting to get heartburn. Excuse me. I'm still craving a lot of mangoes. Mango anything. And today I went to a Jamaican restaurant and they had a Jamaican soda. It was like a juice, a Jamaican juice, and it was the closest thing that satisfied my craving. I've eaten a lot of things with mango, and I'm like, oh, it was okay. But this juice, it was um, so good. I told my husband when he gets off work today, I want him to go get me another one. It was the bomb. I could drink that all day, that in water. I, could, that, I don't need anything else. So just happy that that craving was, has been satisfied. Um, I don't know how much weight I've gained. I haven't been to the doctor in four weeks because the last time I talked to you all, I had been released from my specialist. So I only go to my normal OBGYN. So I don't know how much I weigh, but I'm sure I have gained. My belly is rounding out, but I won't do a belly shot in this video. I'll let hubby um, record me so that I can do a belly shot. And I'll come with more updates. But at this time, I just wanted to come and say hello and so that I could have put a video up. Let you guys know how we're doing. Me and baby are doing fine. Big brothers and daddy is preparing for baby. We're trying to get it together slowly. We bought paint to paint the, the brother's room. Because we, um, to conserve space, we've talked about putting the TVs on the wall. So before we do that, we would like to paint. And um, we bought paint for baby's room. We selected a very light green. It looks kind of, I kind of maybe should have chose a, a darker shade because it's on the can. You know how they kind of dot it so you can see what the color actually looks like. It looks white. It's so light. I'm hoping that once I get it on the walls, it'll get a little darker. I don't, the, even though I chose green, I really believe I probably will go with pink and brown. But I think it'll be a really nice combination. I told you guys that my father passed four years ago. His favorite color was green, so I do things like that to remember him. Well, anyway, you guys, I'm going to let you guys go. This video is about to be over my limit that I can record from my phone. But I will come back and do a separate one. Bye-bye, ladies, and take care. Bye.